Good morning children. Today we shall learn more about pressure, especially Pascal's law. So now we know water or any liquid can apply pressure in all the directions. Let us perform one more experiment. We take a rubber ball filled with water and now we pierce holes in it with pin in different places. If we press it hard, water will rush out of all the holes with equal force. You know, the scientist Pascal said if we apply pressure at any point of confined fluid, it will be transmitted without any change to every other point in the liquid, which means the pressure will be transmitted equally in all the direction. So, the pressure we applied is transmitted equally in all the direction. Thus, water is coming out of all the holes with the same pressure. This is known as Pascal's law or Pascal's principle. So, to sum up what we learned today, today we learned about Pascal's law. This is also known as the principle of transmission of fluid pressure. According to Pascal's law, an external pressure applied to a fluid in a closed vessel is uniformly transmitted throughout the fluid. Which in simple word means pressure applied on one point of the confined liquid is transmitted equally in all the directions. That's all for now. Bye bye children.